Hey guys, how are you all? I am Tamil Silvan Bharathi. It is December 16th. It's a Saturday. Hopefully you guys are having a great weekend so far. You know, this is a music theory video discussion. So if you guys accidentally stumbled on this video and if you are not interested in music theory, then this is not for you. You probably want to really move on to watching other videos on the YouTube. Okay. So for other fellow, you know, music theory um, learners like me, then let us just move on to discuss some more stuff. Okay. So, you know, in my um, channel, I created a new playlist and I called it as, you know, music theory discussions. And I've posted so far, you know, two videos. The first video was a couple of weeks ago and that was just discussing the major scale. And then I did another video discussing the uh, major pentatonic scale. And today, you know, as a continuation of those discussions, let's discuss minor scale. Okay. So, um, uh, you know, as you can see on my, uh, you know, screen right now, I, you know, have a keyboard showing up and then I also have a grand staff showing up. You know, I felt very proud finally when I learned how to do this. In my first video, first two videos, I did it with the horizontal orientation, but then I realized that to put these elements, you know, the grand staff and then the piano keyboard showing up, I was not properly using the real estate of the in a phone, phone screen. So now I changed it to vertical and hopefully you guys really like this better than the other one. My pretty face on the top <laughs> and then in the middle I got the grand staff and then at the bottom I got the piano, you know, window showing up. Uh, you know, I think, see, it's extremely important for us to really learn, you know, sight reading, you know, um, when we learn music, it's extremely important. So we need to know where these notes belong on the grand staff. Western, you know, music, Notation system is the most advanced, you know, music notation system. And I just have begun to really love this. So I'm going to really incorporate this in every one of my video. Even when we discuss uh, the complex Indian raga system, like Kanakangi, for instance, you know, to get that raga, you know, the third note in Kanakangi raga, the third degree, you have to do a double flat. So, and then similarly, when you are, uh, you know, uh, discussing Kanakangi nishadam, you know, you have to do a double flat again. So we are going to discuss all that, you know, using Western notation. And uh, the grand staff is right there in the middle so that we can really dif discuss all of that very effectively. So now, you know, let us quickly recapitulate our major scale discussion, you know, uh, from a couple of weeks ago. So, you know, I'm going to just say something very basic here. Okay. Um, so this is for people who don't even know where the C is on the keyboard okay because you know major scale is from c d e f g a b right c d e f g a b c c b a g f e d c c c c c so some of us you know when we are learning this initially we just just we are very confused about where the heck is the c is so you know on the keyboard you can see that there are white keys okay and then you got the black keys so you got the black keys right so the black keys you can see that they are arranged as groups of twos or threes two three two three two three so the white key before the groups of two in a black key that is your c okay so this so you can see where the green light is glowing on the piano keyboard so c d e f g a b c c b a g a b d c so when you're singing it in the proper solfege system by the way guys you know singing we should always do it with the solfege you know like the do re mi fa so do re mi fa so la ti do do di la so fa mi re do so pleasant right and the major scale typically you know it is just very pleasant and sweet to hear and now let's discuss minor scale so <laughs> you know you'll be very surprised to realize that minor scale uses exactly the same white notes in the piano key all the white notes so this is minor scale 2 so this is major scale 2 and this is also the minor scale it's the same thing but you know what like what einstein pointed it out to us you know theory of relativity the whole thing is relative 
So when you really look at the white key is from C to C. That is major scale. When you start looking at the same white notes from A to A. That's minor. Okay. It's like looking at the coin, you know, differently. When you look at one side, it's got the head. When you look at the other side, it's got the tail. The tail is not able to look at the head by itself. And the head cannot look at the tail. But we, as the viewer, the human mind, we can look at both. Okay, that's the magic. It's kind of Maya thing. Of You know, like Eliraja, you know, always says, It's like that. In music, you know, it's a lot of cheating involved. Because, you know, it's the same thing. But we change the reference point And then we present it as a different thing. Okay. So now let us discuss minor scale. Look at this. So this is from A to A. So now you can see that, you know, what was pleasant, the same white notes when we are playing it, you know, let's actually play the major scale again. Let's change the reference point to C to C. Look at that. C, D, E. It's uplifting. You know, it's, mel you know, very nice, sweet. So the first three notes when you do C, D, E, F, G, A, B, C. C B A G A V D C. This is the major chord, okay? C major chord. So this is, you know, happiness, right? But once you go to the minor scale, now it conveys sadness. It's the same note, but the third note, you know, it is a minor degree. So when you change it, everything changes. So now I'm going to do the minor scale again, and then we'll complete this video. So let's change the reference point to A to A. So, see, when you're singing, you know, you're using A, B, C, right? And when you're singing the major scale, you're doing the, you know, C, D, E. But that's why solfege is very important. Our Sarigama Padanisa. In the Indian system, we call it Sarigama Padanisa. So, no matter what the note is, now you call the first note as Do. So, it's a floating Do. The Do just changes its position now. Do, Re, Mi, Fa, So, La, Ti, Do. Sa, Ri, Ga, Ma, Pa, Da, Mi, Sa, Sa, Ni, Da, Pa, Ma, Ga, Ri, Sa. And by the way, you know, in Indian music, Carnatic music, we call this as Nada Bhairavi. So Nada Bhairavi Ragam, it is the same thing as uh, minor scale. Anyway, it was so good discussing all this with you today. And uh, I'll see you again in my next music theory video. Until then, you guys have a great time, okay? Stay safe, guys. Goodbye.